I want to introduce a new text manuscript today. It is a lapidary by the 11th century French bishop, Marbo of Rennes. A lapidary is to stones what a bestiary is to beasts. That is, it extols the features and especially the magical powers and symbolic meaning of precious stones. Unlike the bestiary, however, which is in prose, Marbode's lapidary is in extremely elegant Latin verse, a poetic tribute to stones, one writer has called it. There are 60 stones in all, and they have so many powers, protecting travelers, assisting lawyers, spotting thieves, multiplying crops. Lapis lazuli, we learn, aids and abets prison escapes. I wonder if that's because its great expense makes it useful as a bribe. I love the idea of magnetite, a kind of iron ore. Placed on a sleeping wife's head, it reveals her faithfulness. If faithful, she rolls over into her husband's arms. If unfaithful, she falls violently out of bed. There are lots of manuscripts, 160 total, and many translations. But surprisingly, it's very rare. Only three copies appear in two centuries in the Schoenberg database. I have never had a copy before. Unlike best Jerry's, they're usually not illustrated, such as this precious little book, more a small handbook for scholars, students, goldsmiths. We don't really know who the original owner was.